It's difficult to overestimate how cracks and damage affect the overall appearance of an object or a scene. Cracks can be found everywhere, from pavement stones to ancient ruins. Despite this, they're one of the most difficult things to model. Until now, the Cracker add-on is a handy little tool for making cracks as easily as possible, and OCD2, or one-click damage, pairs perfectly to create damage on your meshes. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe, then head down to the description for links to get Cracker and OCD2 for yourself. So let's start the sim. Cracker is a really fantastic add-on with a lot of features, including physics-based grounding where you can automatically place cracked objects at ground level, and instant visual feedback where you see adjustments on your model in real time. It gives you a streamlined workflow with intuitive hotkeys that speed up your process. You can adjust crack detail on the fly with your mouse wheel, adjust rotation, noise, scale, width, position, bend, and more. The randomizer gives you unique cracks every time with random rotations and positions around the object's origin, and the chip off function allows you to ship pieces off in just a click. If you want multiple cracks, all you have to do is hold shift while hitting apply to add another crack without separating the object. Cracker also comes with a material breaker for shattering windows, and a stomper tool for creating cracks and displacing cracked objects afterwards. This add-on makes it even easier by showing you all the hotkeys you need to know while you're creating your cracks. If you're a Blender artist looking to accelerate and simplify your environment or prop art workflow, here's a handy tool set that might help you out. With physics-based grounding, you can drop crack pieces to the ground by pressing Control, Shift, and the left mouse button. Remember, this feature leverages rigid body simulation, so always include a passive rigid body ground object in your scene. Use the S key for noise adjustments, the R key for rotation, G to move your crack, T to change the width of your crack, B to bend it, D for the displacement amount, Shift C to move your crack to the 3D cursor position, Q for taper, the mouse wheel for your details, Control or Command to delete the smallest piece. You can use Shift and the left mouse button to continue placing cracks without splitting your object. Cracker also comes with the stomper tool. Select one or more objects and hit Control R to activate the stomper tool. Use the left mouse button to apply and the right mouse button to cancel. The stomper tool only works on horizontal surfaces for now. Want to make cracks in a window? You can do that with the Cracker tool as well. Press Alt-Y in object mode to choose the breaker tool and adjust for your desired look. The object should be a flat surface with thickness, the front face must be a single polygon, and remember to apply scale before using. For now, the material breaker can't break round objects like a vase, cups, etc. One thing that's important to remember is that Cracker works with real geometry, and it is destructive, so make sure you use a backup copy of your object or scene beforehand. Cracker isn't like other crack tools. The amount of customization it offers is beyond anything in this price range. Cracker also works perfectly with the OCD, or one-click damage, add-on, and it's definitely worth getting the damage bundle if you can afford that investment, as opposed to buying the add-on separately. Now, a little more about OCD. One-click damage is as easy to use is Cracker, and they really do make a perfect pairing. OCD adds realistic wear with no effort, and enough adjustments to create the damage you're looking for. Just choose your model, adjust, and instantly enjoy a highly detailed, lifelike asset. Realism in CGI hinges on the details, especially the imperfect ones. This really infuses your model with the essence of reality. From subtle wear on a new wall, to the deep scars in ancient ruins, OCD will add those authentic touches that tell a story. Perfect for stone, concrete, or brick structures, it's your shortcut to creating models that truly resonate with the real world. The full version also includes hero mode, which adds even more details to your model. There's so many things in OCD that make it one of the best damage tools in the Blender market. Noise patterns can be changed with a single button, and procedural noises mean hundreds of unique damage variations. OCD works on any object and unit scale, and the slim UI offers easy navigation with essential sliders. There are no hotkeys to learn or remember to use one-click damage, making it not only one of the best, but one of the simplest flexible damage tools available. At only $2, the light version can give you a little taste of what one-click damage can do, with make damage, smart scale, and noise selection. But the full version includes auto material assignment, pattern changers, multi-selection damage, recall, instant damage, quick fix, and the hero module. What makes this different than any other damage tools? Besides the amount of customization that's possible, the quality is better than most similar add-ons out there. The options with Make Damage are already more than what other damage tools offer, and Hero Mode just expands on that. For only $34, you can purchase both of these tools together and save yourself some money. Since OCD and Cracker function together, they're a match made in heaven. From statues, sidewalks, broken old stone walls, more realistic bricks, the list goes on and on. Don't forget, we have links down in the video description for each one of these offers, so make sure you check them out for yourself. What are your favorite crack and damage tools? Let us know down in the comments, and of course, as always, take care of yourself and each other.